Happy birthday, Mum. Happy birthday, Mum. Happy birthday, LS. Happy birthday, LS. Happy birthday, LS. Happy birthday, Mum. Happy birthday, LS. Mwah. Lade Jobby House, 16 Awolowa Way, Ilisha Remo, Ogun State. A plain host to the most celebrated faces in Nigeria poet and writers. Everyone came together to celebrate the 50th birthday of a stylish lady of high society, Lola Shonei. From the selection of guests at the event to the venue itself, it was obvious that a super gorgeous celebrant wasn't going to joke with such a significant day. The weekend of bountiful merriment was a culmination of a celebration which began early that morning with a special presentation of poetry readings as it featured celebrating the love of letters by a student poet, those she role models, amongst other inspiring personalities. Personalities. Guests were first treated to palm wine cocktails and remo delicacies. As you withdrew pregnant to the grinding stone, still. <laughs> there was a dance drama showcased by drummers and Egugu Masquade of Itun. <laughs> Editor, publisher, bookseller, and festival organizer, Lola Shonei is the mastermind behind Ake Festival, which is about Ake art and book festival. Over the years, Ake Festival has brought over 1,000 writers, poets, musicians, actors, filmmakers, artists, and thinkers together to celebrate creativity, network, and share stories. The fantastic program included panel discussions, book chat, poetry, and music in a bid to promote literacy, especially among children of school-going age, to develop reading tools and resources to support schools in the creation of reading spaces, and to organize events and festivals that promote literacy, reading, and culture. Some of the big names in attendance were Professor Niyi Oshundari, Wana Udo Bank, amongst all the dignitaries. Um, right from the beginning, you could see the fire in Lola's eyes and the fire in her, in her heart. The passion for the art, the passion for the book, the passion for knowledge. And you also saw a certain level of creative restlessness at odumodun la todumodun ato shumoshu la to shumoshu ase yi samodun wa se le yi wa tun se mi lola please click keep up the spirit owanbe party followed which featured refreshment and entertainment Everything was on point and no stone was left unturned. The guests and family members invited were treated to the very best party going experience. An extra toe, you know, that which my mother had. She, she's got it. I want her further success and uh, popularity. She's so loving, you know, she, she never lets you say a bad thing about yourself, you know, so positive and sees the good in everyone and wants to bring out the best in you and nurture the positive. Um, I don't know if she remembers like the personal encounter we had, but she's, she's such a sweet person. Like she's someone I look up to. A whole lot of things she has achieved as a woman in the literary scene. One thing I've learned from her, I would say is if you love something and it's your passion, just keep going, keep trying at it and don't give up. I work so hard because my, my mom is the hardest working person I, I know. She never stops, she's always going and it's given me the, uh, the courage to work hard. LS is amazing! <laughs> okay, yeah, I mean, LS, beyond being an author and a poet, she's like the queen mother of literature in Africa. And I use the word queen mother because not just is she involved in the writing and performance poetry and festival, the fact that she has also birthed a place like Wida that's published a lot of authors within Nigeria and beyond. Lola Shunei was heavily supported by her closest family, friend, and confident 
on the occasion. They all showed up ready to party and they did not disappoint as pictures and videos showed all of them throw it down on the dance floor as they celebrated with their friend and loved one. Well wishers described the celebrant as a problem solution entity owing to her imaginative power and beauty of thought and language respectively. My darling, um, it's great to be here with you on your 50th. Um, I said that you are getting on, but when I tell people that I am often called a cradle snatcher for marrying you, they will understand that uh, uh, I'm also having a dig at myself because I'm getting on. But uh, I can't think of a better person to be with in the golden years of my life. So I wish you a wonderful day today. I'm here with you physically and in spirit. And I look forward to sharing the rest of the wonderful golden years that you have and I have left as time goes forward. Love you. Good friend to me. I was really excited to read her book. And after I'd read her book, she sent me a message and then we got in touch. And it's been fantastic to have been invited here. She's helped me with my reading of Nigerian books and directed me to places to go. So it's been really lovely. My wishes are happiness and joy and more laughter. I feel like LS doesn't, she doesn't give herself her own flowers and she deserves that. She deserves a lot of joy. She deserves to receive, she deserves to receive a lot of love. The lovely and refreshingly gorgeous looking celebrant thanked God for his faithfulness in her life as well as the success of her 50th birthday celebration. Oh! 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 Hey! Oh! It's always been about, about giving um, and I do it out of gratitude largely to those who have given so much to me. She's the best mom in the world. She's the funniest person I know. The most beautiful, kind-hearted, caring woman that sits on planet Earth. And I know you don't know what I would do without her and I will never have to find out. Well, I think she's done an amazing job at really putting uh, a Nigerian literature on the map. She's been a supporting, she's been a dynamic force also to support young people. The life band and brilliant DJ dished out some classic music which got the guests knocking their feet on the ground in synchrony to the danceable tunes. Luxurious wine flowed around like water. Even the menu was so delicious, some of the guests had to have another helping or two. She swayed beautifully on the dance floor, captivating everyone with her movement. But no one shone like the celebrant, Lola Shoneyi. <laughs> Wishing Lola Shunei a fun-filled fabulous 50th.